Can three bags of pine shavings stop a bullet? Only one way to pine out. Let's shoot these with different calibers till something goes through. We're gonna lay these down hot dog style to give them the best possible chance of survival. Getting started with a round of 22. Tipman M422. Okay guys, our 22 entered right there. That's our hole. This does not appear to have gone through our first bale at all. Nine millimeter. Glock 19 and our conversion kit. Looks like our nine millimeter hit right there, dead center. And this one guys went through our first bale and into the second, but did not breach the second. 45 ACP, 1911. Our 45 lodged right here, that's our entry guys. And this actually went through just like the nine millimeter uh, and breached our second bale of pine shavings, but like the nine mil, did not go through. 410 gauge, shotgun slug. Caltech, KSG. Looks like our 410 gauge slug entered right here. And this one guys actually came through the first bale into the second and skirted out the side of bale two right here. 300 blackout. The butter ferret. Okay guys, 300 blackout likes to tumble, so I wanted to hit center mass, that's where we impacted, right there. Started going crazy and came out the corner of bale one, right there. Just entered bale two, right there, you can see that coming in sideways. And she died immediately, came out and hit the table on the bottom of bale two. Five, five, six. Geisley, ALG defense. All right, guys, our round of 556 five, entered right there. That's our entry. This thing came through. That's our exit in bail one, went into bail two right there. And we've shot this thing twice, guys, but this thing keeps tumbling out the side. Our 556 five, exited out the side of bail two right there. Moving on to 308, Palmetto State Armory, Jackal 10. Looks like our 308 entered right here, guys, right next to our 556 five, hole. And this round went entirely through bail one came out right there, entered bale two here, and came out bale two right there. Now this round started creeping up, which was interesting. There's our entry into bale three, and this guy actually poked out the top of bale three and went into our berm. Okay guys, I think we learned these are probably a safe bet to hide behind. Just don't stand to the side of them because they like to make the rounds tumble. Anywho, what should we shoot next time? Pants is gonna bail out.